about the sea life of these fascinating creatures. Purpose. The purpose of our business is to create a unique place for families and for tourists to come and visit for Wayne and see things they've never seen before. It brings in people to the community, and it saves animals because um, by bringing in species, because we're going to have things when they come in, and we have the animals. And my education, we have camps and things I would teach the kids about the animals and sea life. And for family and entertainment, it is it brings families together. And has moving closer. The location of our business is 5300 Decatur Road, which is where the old Scots is located. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> uh, we chose this location because it's like kind of in the middle of everything, and like, but it's not downtown yet, so it won't be very busy to get to, and like a lot of people can get to it. Um, we decided to that we're going to tear down this building and build a new one so that it will look like this. Um, whenever you first walk in, you're going to see like it's going to be like a big shark tank to catch your attention. And then there's going to be two stores, and it, the design of it is that it's going to look like a fishbowl. That's kind of the idea, so that they get like it's an aquarium. Um, it's going to be longer than it is tall. Well, no, it's going to be more tall than it is long, so that because it's going to have stories, and we're going to have a slide like inside of it, so that like the kids it'll t catch their attention because they have a very strong attention span and they might get bored, so like they'll be able to slide down, it'll be glass, and so they'll be able to see like all the animals whenever they're going down. For demographics, we chose the, the zip code 46806. Um, the largest race in the zip code is black. The total Hispanic population zip code is 4,135. The average age of citizens in the, in the zip code is about, I uh, put this picture on here, um, it's about zero to 20 is the highest one. And so like, we thought we'd have a lot of business because you know, younger people like to get out and do things. And so the location of the zip code is by Way Trace with Middle Park and South Anthony Boulevard. The average size of the household is three people. The median household income in 2011 is 28,154. Uh, our competition of Shed Aquarium and Little Turtle Book Cards because our aquarium is more like just having the animals and the kids there to go for have fun and go to the tubes. And we're basically just trying to get our be a shed aquarium because that's some you know, competition and we do turn the parts around the middle of the year. And we're just trying to make it better for the kids and Budget, the building cost for it is eight hundred and ninety five thousand dollars and the building renovation cost is eighteen million dollars. The external cost of the wages and benefits is three hundred and twenty thousand three hundred and twenty thousand dollars for four beds, sixty seven thousand a year for research management. The guest ambassador makes twelve dollars an hour and the selling selling this cost is seven million and the total of our budget is nine million. By having this, it, we're going to make a lot of money, we assume, because we're going to charge $15 an adult, which is 15 and up, and then $12 for lower. Um, we uh, estimate about 200,000 to 600,000 visitors um, a year, because we looked at the Fort Wayne Zoo's visitors, and they have about 630,000, but um, and then we look at Shed Aquarium, and they have about 2 million visitors a year. But Chicago's uh, population is also a lot larger than ours, and so we lowered that down. And so we just assumed that, well, estimated, <laughs> that we have about 600,000 people come to our aquarium each year. And the benefits for people for is we want people to come 
busy because it's going to be a lot of fun for slides to the aquarium and the food places we got there. So we just trying to make people be happy and have fun there instead of just just watching animals and being bored. For jobs, we uh, realized that Fort Wayne doesn't have a lot of jobs, and so by having an aquarium, we're going to need a lot of people to work there. And so, a lot of more people will be able to get jobs at the aquarium that might be unemployed right now. And so, we feel like it'll really help Fort Wayne. And for recreation, it will allow people to have fun and to experience new things in Fort Wayne that they've never seen before. So, the place is more relaxation and things like thought was where are you going to get the animals from? Uh, we're going to have a rescue thing so we'll get some animals from rescuing them and others we're going to buy. And that's factored into your budget? Uh, 